This is my little girl. And this is the first feeding of the day. It's about 9.30. Usually when I get up, I give them some weaning pellets or something. And then I do the birds and get that stuff done. And then it's time for these guys. She's not that impressed. Come on, sweetie. But Mama's got... But Mama's got for you. Come on. There we go. Over here. Very hard to do this with one hand. <laughs> Good girl. She's not quite as voracious as the rest of them tend to be. And she's also more petite. She just weighed in at 312, which seems to be pretty normal for her. You're a good girl, huh? What you doing? She is still the only one that's up on a perch. And the other guys, there's the usual honking. Hi, sweetie. So I just finished feeding her. You hear the honking in the background still. <laughs> That's the big boy. She's pretty sweet. Yeah, good girl, huh? Let's see, she is 67 days old today. You good girl, huh? Yes, you are. You're a good girl. is Frankie on the scale and my girl making an escape from the basket. Frankie weighs 348 grams. Wow. Frankie tends to lean in and help himself like that. He's a good boy. He is a good boy. Yeah. So he is uh, 63 he yeah, has 63 days old today, the youngest. She's on the move over here. And there's Mr. Honker. Okay. This is Frankie, and I just finished feeding him. And his nails have gotten sharp again. Gonna have to get the Dremel out later. Hey, good boy, huh? You've got some sharp, sharp nails there, Frankie. You're telling me. Okay. How pretty you are, huh? Look at these gorgeous pink feathers. Hey, don't eat my camera. Hey, 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 lady. She was trying to eat my camera. I've just got it balanced on top of the scale while I'm trying to get pictures of these guys. Videos are not easy with only me. Here's the big boy on the scale at 300 and, wow, 368 grams. He's 68 days old. He's huge. I'm gonna feed him now. Yeah, he helps himself too. The boys definitely have a bit different personalities from the girls. They tend to be Usually they tend to be bolder, although, as I said, she's the one that's up on the perches and trying to climb around and stuff, so it's not always true. Right now, that's her that was, she was just pecking at the bread, and he's ready to make an escape because he always does. Yeah, I'll finish feeding you, sweetie. This is the big boy. So much red on him. It's very weird. He's the oldest one, and yet he's the one with more quills that still haven't opened up yet. Yeah, 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 you're a porcupine still. And yet you're the big boy. I know, it's so weird, huh? Yeah. He is quite the honker, always. We can always tell you. Yeah, we can always tell who you are. You're the big mouth. Yes, you are. Alright, I gotta clean the cage out now, so you go sit with your brother and sister, okay? Okay, cage is all clean. 
what I've been giving them is um, a dish of Cheerios in the back. They have Cheerios up a little bit higher, tons of millet. Today, for the first time, they got a piece of a uh, tangerine cut in half with the, you know, the rind and everything. Maybe I've picked at it a little bit, but not much. They've got Zupreme pellets. They've got a tropical carnival mix, which is basically dried fruit and nuts. And in their regular dish, which nobody's managed to get up to yet, but I know eventually they will, there's a little bit of seed and, and pellets and stuff. And then, of course, they have water. Um, I clean the cake 8 million times a day because it's got the grate, which I love, but their feet go through the grate, and I don't want them stepping in their poop and stuff and getting messy. Um, the grates are wonderful. It drives me crazy when people have grates and then they put the newspaper on top of the grate. That totally defeats the purpose. The purpose is to keep them away from picking at their poop, which makes a lot of sense. But, you know, some people, they don't like the extra effort of having to clean the grate. And yeah, you do have to clean it a lot because stuff gets stuck to it. But it serves the purpose very, very well. So the kids right now have all been fed. They're waiting to go back into a clean cage. They've been poking at things and climbing around the usual. <laughs> what? You guys, you're so cute. Yes, you are. You're so cute. You are such cutie pies. Piece of Cheerio. Yeah, it's a piece of Cheerio. Hey, you ready to go back? Don't eat my bread. Are you ready to go back? Yeah? Alright. That was your close-up for the day. Back into a nice clean cage. Big guy says, I'm still hungry, ma. Yeah, I see you. I don't have anything for you. You're going to have to pick on your own. Let's see. My girl is already picking at some pellets. Frankie is back here looking cute. Yes, Mr. Honks. Don't stand on that apple, on that orange, eat it. You're going to eat some of that, huh? You're going to get your piggies all sticky. You are. Hey, cutie. So anyway, that's it for a little bit. And see, she is picking still. That's a good girl. What a good girl. You're more self-reliant than your brother's. You know how these boys are. Yeah. What a good girl you are. Alright, this is getting long, so I'll cut it off here.